So here I have a model with a resolution of 704 on the Dynamesh and active point count of around 600,000. Um, you can see that there are some details, not nothing particularly heavy or detailed, some sharp edges on our um, hard surface areas and some thin horns up here. So if I was to Dynamesh this and hit project, You'll see that because I didn't change the resolution on this, um, I'm still around the 615,000 mark and nothing really changed. Where this actually comes into effect is if I if I turn this down and I go down to say 200 or thereabouts and I dynamesh this without project turned on, you'll see that suddenly our edges get a little bit fuzzier. I'll just redo that. That's before, this is after. So we lose an awful lot of detail on all of the organic areas. Our horns uh, get destroyed um, and this gets fuzzy and unsharp. So I'll just undo that. And this time I'll do the same operation with project turned on. And you'll see this time we've actually managed to keep the sharpness in these areas here because it's effectively tessellated it in order to keep that detail as best as it could. It's also even tried to maintain some of the details, the finer detail. But the horn stuff up here is, while better, still not good enough to actually use. So how this works is you're actually better off not using the project option inside Dynamesh. If you turn it off, you're going to get more expected results when you are actually lowering resolution. If you're lowering resolution, you're probably expecting to lose detail anyway and you're probably doing it for a reason so generally i'd turn that off the only time you'd ever really have it on is if you do have something like a, a hard surface or something like that and you want to dynamesh it and you want to keep the edges if i try and dynamesh this without and um, project turned on you see all of our edges go fuzzy but if for some reason i wanted to keep those edges i'll just turn project on those edges are, are maintained nice and sharp and we still have relatively low resolution to sculpt with so if we were sculpting with clay we could turn on sculptress pro on our brush and then sculpt on this and so this will minimize the amount of polygons that we, we might need on this pretty much that's the only time you'll use project is for the hard surfaces um, and even then not very often so as a rule turn it off i think it's turned off by default turn your blur down to zero um, and when you are dynameshing uh, organic surfaces, just make sure that it's like that. Hope this tip helps. And as usual, any questions, put them in the comments and feel free to subscribe and like and all that. Thanks. Bye.